So Gurpreet, we talk about resume and LinkedIn, and we kind of touched base in the previous videos about the storytelling part, especially in the about section on LinkedIn. But we know that it's important for job seekers to know their stories and they can share it on, on the about section on LinkedIn, but also they can share it on uh, cover letters and even sometimes on their LinkedIn, uh, their resume part. So in your expertise, how can people get better in telling their stories? Um, how can you get better in telling your stories? The betterness comes from, I would say, remove you out of the element. Uh, if you want to tell a story on resumes, it's not about you at that moment, right? When you're in front of somebody, that's a different story. But when you're trying to get in front of somebody, it's not about you at all. You will never get someone's attention when you're talking about yourself. So I would say the storytelling comes into play like on LinkedIn, about section, resume, cover letters is when you flip the script to make it about them and tell their story. Mm. So this is where you need to know what their problem is so that you can say, hey, you know, are you struggling with X, Y, and Z? Like I just did this with a client. He's an expert in uh, generating additional revenues, like let's say 200, 200 million. Like it sounds ridiculous, but it's true. Like that's his expertise that we unlock discovered. And then that's kind of how we started to market and pitch him is that he's an expert that can generate additional revenues of nearly 200 K. Mm -hmm. And then for LinkedIn, we had a, uh, you know, people call it hook. I call it bomb dropping, but like a hook that grabs yeah, the attention and we're hitting on the pain. Like, are you struggling to make X or do you want to make additional 200 K at uh, $200 million in mm -hmm. revenue? If you said yes, Here's how stay tuned. I'm going to teach, I'm going to walk you through how you can do it. Right yeah. now you got them because on a, something that they want So get, that's the story, mm -hmm. get them on what they want, touch on their problem or what they want, immediate want, then walk them through how you can make that happen, which is your method or your process. Mm -hmm. And then you can talk about, then yes, you can a little bit then start talking about like, you know, maybe even featured uh, won awards and so on, success stories of your uh, companies you've yeah. worked on, have, like a little bit of a that. And then you can say, hey, message me, ping me, call to action. Yeah. See, the storytelling is still there, but it's done from, it's about the the employer, it's the right. audience you want to attract. So making it about them and not about you. And then that's how you would do it on a resume LinkedIn and so on. But if you were to tell a story in an interview, then like, you know, tell me about yourself. That's a storytelling. That's about you, but it should be about your career. What's your career story? How did you get into the how career? Did, how did it end up here? Yeah. How did you start? Why, why did you pursue that career? What, like, I have a unique story in how I landed in nature. A lot of people do I have a story of how they yeah. land in their, mm -hmm. and then your top five podcasts, what keeps you going? What's your mission? your vision and your, like what's your mission i got very clear right from the get-go of my hr career that my mission is going to be to create work environment where people feel like they're at home yeah safety that's uh you know that environment and that was my entire mission and still is at working in hr so speak on that what's your mission mm -hmm. um and the impact you want to make and that's something we can incorporate as well on, in your about section at the end, yeah. like your mission and the impact you're making and want to make. Yeah. yeah. Those are great tips, Gurpreet. Thank you very much. And again, for the audience, if you have any more tips in terms of storytelling, you can leave them below. And tune in next time for my final question with Gurpreet. Gurpreet.